the numbers you're already familiar with are all greater than zero, such as four or seven, but sometimes it's necessary to use numbers that are less than zero. So the number line is actually extended to the left of zero. And these are called negative numbers. And negative numbers get smaller the farther away from zero you move. And the numbers to the right are called positive numbers, and they get larger the farther away from zero you move. Negative numbers have a negative sign or a minus sign in front of them, and positive numbers have a plus or a positive sign in front of them. If a number doesn't have a negative or a positive sign, it's considered to be positive. A common situation where you've used negative numbers before is a thermometer, which is really just a vertical number line where zero is the temperature where water freezes. And you can see that on this thermometer, the temperature is at negative 34 degrees Celsius, so it would be quite cold out. And opposite integers are numbers that are the same distance from zero. So negative four and four are called opposite integers. And seven, positive seven and negative seven are also called opposite integers. Another situation where you might use negative numbers is if you owe somebody money, you might say you have negative dollars. For instance, if you owe somebody four dollars, you have negative four dollars. So the numbers on the number line, including positive and negative numbers, are called integers.